taking the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. Crypto Lightsaber back with another video, guys. In today's video, we're going to cover Splassive, which is having a little bit of a pump. Um, I say a little bit of a pump. It's actually done about 3x, um, maybe even a little bit more. It was down at around two and a half cents. It is now at 13 cents. So being a very nice pump in Splassive, there is a reason behind this. They've also got some things coming in the pipeline um, related to that reason. But it's good to see some price action, some upward price action out of this project. Um, the team can be pretty quiet in terms of AMAs and things like that. They very rarely do them. They have a small AMAs in the chat group. They do continue to build. That's one thing I can say for this team. They have an announcement of a new, um, well, let's just have a look, right? They've put an announcement out about a new service, right? It's a, a copy trading service, should I say, okay? We are proud to announce our new copy trading service called Splash Trading. You will be able to copy our trades on Finandi and grow your USDT bag passively. After intensive testing, we think that our strategy is mature, enough to be shared with our sweet community. We have seen daily APRs between 2% and 10%, but of course, previous results don't guarantee future results. So, um, yeah, we'll get back into the announcement um, in a minute and talk about the requirements and things like that. But as you can see, they've got some trading going on on this Finandi uh, website okay and these are the results that they've been getting okay you got 2.6 percent here 6.9 percent up to 10 percent on the highest day of their trading okay we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten days worth of trading so there is uh, some testing going on which is continuing i have actually been invited into test this i've been super busy um but um yeah, I mean, I've got around to looking at things now. I will say that this does look pretty bullish in my opinion. And of course, the price action doesn't lie. The chart doesn't lie. It has been pumping. All right, guys, off the back of this news. All right, guys, so if we look at the finandy.com website, which I haven't done at the moment, okay? Um, so this is going to be the first time I'm actually logging onto the website. But this is the website that they're using to trade. But you do have to have at least 5,000 splash um, deposited in the tap to take advantage of this all right guys so um it actually trades usdt and like it says on the thing is two to ten percent a day let's just read the rest of the announcement uh because we are offering the service for free we only want our community to benefit from it to become eligible you will need to have at least five thousand splash state in the tap we will have a page on Finandi with tutorials and a form to link your Splash wallet with your Finandi account. So again, you need to have 5,000 in a tap. Me personally, I have two maxed accounts and I have a third account, um, which I am building as well that I've just been compounding on. So for me personally, you know, I would qualify for this, right? The question is, would I want to take advantage of it, put USDT E into this thing to start getting those trading fees, right? Or sorry, not trading fees, those uh, that, that ROI on USDT. It would be very beneficial in this market, right? And, you know, let's just read because um, uh, this is not gonna require you to lock up funds and all that sort of stuff. There's no deposit fees and all that sort of stuff. So let's just read the rest of the announcement. What we don't like about other projects, they hold your money, they are heavy, they, uh, they, there are heavy deposits and withdrawal taxes you can withdraw wherever you want so just to touch on that we know stable fund right i was invested in stable fund stable fund have paused and they've stopped withdrawals and all that sort of stuff they're saying they're going to do refunds and things like that um that is a whole nother video what we offer splassive that is no deposit taxes no withdrawal taxes it's your account so you can do whatever you want with it you can also withdraw whenever you want we'll have an 18 percent profit sharing fee applied weekly by finandy uh, okay, so that answers how they make their money, right? Only if you are profitable. Parts of those profits will be used to buy back Splash and deposit in a tap. Okay, so how they're going to make money is that basically on the profits, they're going to charge you 18%. Only if you're profitable, of course. If it doesn't make a profit, then you don't get charged. There's going to be an 18% profit sharing fee on that. 
and Finandi, the platform is called Finandi. They are a Binance broker exchange created in March 2020, so they've been around for two years, um, two and a half years. To create an account is free. They make money with the volume. They charge little fees on top of Binance's fees. The UI is blah, blah, blah. When launched, so the service is currently in private test mode with a little group. Public launch will happen on Thursday during an AMA. Okay, guys, so this has contributed to the pump. And, um, you know, one thing I can say about this team is they are constantly building things. Um, I mean, we have been waiting for the Splash Games. We've been waiting for the roulette and all that sort of stuff. I think this is way more bullish than all of those things. We've seen a lot of hype on trading bots and just trading in general. However, we've seen those projects not really do well in the longer term, right? Um, I wouldn't say not do well, but, you know, I think we can blame the team uh, for, you know, some things that have happened and so on. Our stable fund, for example. Then there was another one, the crypto, uh, crypto Gems trading that shut down. Uh, we've seen quite a few of these trading platforms shut down. And when, when you have to lock up your funds for 28 days, it is super risky. You don't know whether they're going to shut down within 28 days. After 28 days, for example, like stable fund, you can withdraw your funds. Me, like a fool, I left my funds in stable fund and allowed them to continue generating, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, fees or profit, sorry, on the trading. Um, so, you know, I lost about 30,000 Matic in the stable fund thing i'm waiting for a refund that may not come may or may not come i don't know but um you know it's not an easy pill to swallow when you know you you could have withdrawn uh, and you didn't but you know with something like this i mean it's, it's it's still something i need to consider whether i'll get into it or not but one thing's for sure is that i am in splash or splashive right and uh we're seeing the benefits from the price action on this so with three, with two max accounts and one account that I'm building, right now, even in these market conditions, the fact that the price has come up, um, I'm making approximately 150, maybe $150 a day on Splashes still, which is pretty good considering the circumstances. And uh, if the price goes up further, then, you know, that's going to put me in a much better place. At one point, I was making thousands of dollars a day just on Splashive, okay? But uh, yeah, the price did come down. I think at one point the the, the price of Splash was like fifty dollars, uh, but now it's down to thirteen cents. And um, yeah, I mean, really not m much else I can say. Price is pumping. Uh, Wave, of course, is their second token, which has been moving up as well. So yeah, pretty bullish news for Splashiv. I'm glad to see that they've still got things going on. They're taking it. They they are watching the market. They're taking advantage of the you know what's hot and what's not. They created a Zen game as well, something to do with that. I haven't looked into it properly. You've got the roulette, you've got the splash uh, game, uh, you've got uh, the the splash pads which they shut down actually. Um, but yeah, I mean, it is on Avax and Avax. There's not a lot of hype around uh, Avax at the moment. But for those of us that are in it, for those that are you know looking for projects that you know have a honest team. Okay, yes, there was an exploit back in the day. But um, I think they've come back from that. The price action obviously tells its own story. But uh, the whole market has been bearish as a whole. So um, I don't want to hold that against them. You can't force people to buy and hold and all that sort of stuff. But, you know, the, the way the system is set up, it incentivizes you to stake your splash. Okay, guys. So I would say it would be nice if they had more AMAs, more promo, and things like that. But, you know, in the bear market, Paying for promo and stuff like that, it doesn't really give you a good return on your investment. Let's just hope when the markets turn back bullish, splash, uh, splashive, uh, splash, splashive can survive uh, <laughs> with uh, you know things like Drip Network and things like that, EMP money. Okay, guys, so just wanted to give you that update. Looking bullish, uh, in my opinion. Let me know what you think in the comments. That is the end of the video. If you're not subscribed to the channel, make sure you subscribe. Hit the little bell for notifications. Like the video, which helps with the YouTube algorithm. And I'll see you in the very next one.